Hello guys, Solid Screamer here, and today I'll be reviewing the Starlight's Vision Novel. I made a video on this Vision Novel before, but I had pictures in the video, and it isn't safe to show that. Not because pictures were explicit, but because of copyright. Also, my last video on this Vision Novel still wasn't family friendly enough, so this video is more family friendly. Starless is one of the most well-known vision novels out there because of how disgusting and grotesque it was. It's a game that you're unsure of playing because of all the talk about how disgusting it really is. Is it really as disgusting as people say it is, or are people just over-exaggerating? In Starless, the main character Solitari gets hired as a butler at a mansion where rich women have certain chores that they want him to do. What he doesn't know is how messed up these women really are. I played the entire game, and I can say without a doubt, this is the most disgusting vision novel I have ever played through. Not the most disturbing, but the most disgusting. Some of the scenes were so sickening that I either had to quickly click through them or avoid looking at them altogether. Does the fact that this game is so disgusting make it a bad vision novel? Specific vision novels are targeted towards a certain audience, so it's hard to say if a particular game is bad. This game is obviously not targeted towards people that casually play vision novels. It's more for a specific group of people that love seeing disgusting things. To criticize Starless, for its extreme content is like complaining that a vanilla game is too lighthearted, or saying a dark vision novel is too messed up. If I was in a specific group of people that like discussing content, I would say this vision novel did a great job at giving the fans what they want to see. People essentially want a vision novel where the main character had to follow every order that the women gave him, and they wanted to see discussing scenes as well. If you're going into this expecting dark scenes like in Conquering the Queen or He Told Me My Stepsister, then you'll be highly disappointed. Those vision novels are dark, but don't have anything too extreme. They're pleasing to look at. The eight scenes in Star Wars, though, are meant to be disgusting and be something you don't see too often in vision novels. When you see the same kind of scenes over and over, it does get kind of boring. So it's no surprise why people want to see disgusting eight scenes that are very unique. Some people are into extreme content, and this is their thing. All of the women in this vision novel are hot, and you're less satisfied with how they boss the main character around. For those that love it when women boss them around, you'll love this vision novel. The women here have complete control over the main character and do whatever they want with him. Not only is the art amazing, but the music's great as well. As for the story, well, this is a game mostly about disgusting age scenes, so of course, there wasn't going to be a story. I can't complain about the lack of plot because obviously that wasn't the purpose of this vision novel. I would only recommend to play this vision novel if you are used to seeing disgusting age scenes in vision novels. Otherwise, you'll just be complaining about it. I give this vision novel a 8 out of 10. So that's all I want to talk about for today. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great day night wherever you are. And please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And please comment if you found anything interesting in the video.